welcome back from the break right here on KTN Home. You are watching the tea and we have a lot of tea to spill. I am Sarah Common and I'm joined by Laura Mbatha and we're still on Kenyans doing fantastic things. Don't forget the hashtag is hashtag KTN the tea and can look at us on YouTube because we're international you guys. <laughs> All day, every day. Duh. Plus. Uh -huh. Now I want to talk about somebody who I think the whole family be winning. Mm -hmm. Our CS, mm -hmm. Amina, yeah. has a daughter who goes under the name, I want to say this name properly, guys, yeah? So, Nisimoy, mm -hmm. say it with me. Ferial Nur Al Hussein. Mm -hmm. She's gorgeous, first mm -hmm. of all, if you've never ever seen her. Ooh, but more gorgeous. importantly, she is a manager at Gucci. Yeah. The real Gucci. See, is it in your query? Mm. Ina kujanga na in your query. In a kujanga na box, in a dikwa Gucci. Mm. And it comes with a, a certificate. Yes. Yeah. So that when you're reselling, it still has. Like, Do you think somewhere. that explains where the Kenyan budget goes most of the time during the. I'm joking. Me, I didn't ask anything like that. Mm. Nasiku's Kevin Yomesema. Moving on swiftly. But. <laughs> Earlier last year, I mean, sometime last year, you guys would have noticed that Google changed its logo. Yes. You know the Google thing, like when you go on the main site, and to celebrate the Kenya Sign Language founder, Professor, Professor, of course, of course, eh, of course, Benange, you're doing so well. Eh, hey, following behind the footsteps of Obam. There's, is there any other yeah. Kenyan that has ever made them change their sign? Who? I don't think so. No. Only those two. Congratulations. Mm -hmm. He's been very, very, very supportive of the yeah. deaf society in Kenya. Mm -hmm. And some of you guys may not know this, but sign language is specific to the language. You know me, I thought, and it's anywhere in the it's world. Eh. But actually, that doesn't make any sense. Can it I be honest? Be... Until you said that, I really just thought that. Literally, guys, I learned this last year. Mm. Yeah. I learned that right now, guys. You learn something new every day. Exactly. So he's done incredible work, also working together with people who've helped make. Um, they're like gloves mm. that you wear, and when you do the sign language, it can be programmed into like a computer mm. or a laptop, and then everybody in the world, it can be translated mm. to other languages and stuff. And it just made it a lot easier for deaf people to do international yeah. courses or to do any work where they need to work with the international community. So shout out to you, Prof. Imagine. Now we wanted to do um, three people who we really admire in the fashion mm. world. So we're each gonna like take a turn, but they can be local, international, mm. outside of Kenya. So take it away. Who would you say is your number one? Locally, I will definitely have to say, Stura, come on one of them. Oh definitely. my God! She has very good style and I love your hairstyles and your nails are always on point. I think you should have like a reel that showcases all the nail styles you have. That's not a bad idea because I think I have the pictures. You have very good style when it comes to nails and your hair is good. You. Very nice taste in lipstick. I think you're very good looking. Nice, nice looking lady. Yeah. Gosh, uh, una fanyani blush. There's a new girl that I really am crushing on. She's called Stephanie Nganga. I think mm. that's even her handle. She's doing so well. And then she's collaborating with all these other um, yeah. fashion influencers. They do color blocking looks uh, and they do like all green looks, all yeah. beige looks, all black. And it's just so nice mm. and I'm loving it. I, I mean, I, I channel my inner secretary, Sunday wrong right here. Right, yeah? But uh, uh, PG, we're keeping it PG. You know, we're keeping it PG. <laughs> Locally, I'm actually gonna pick somebody a little out of the box. I'm mm. gonna go with a guy. Yeah. Because I feel like Kenyan babes, Ooh. we be trying, we be cute all the time. Yeah. You men. Zero effort. Mus. Aki jaribu nyanyewe. Aki anani. Aki anakwambia ni. Lakini ni luwashe trouser jana. That is not trying. Ah ah. So I'm going to single out Seth Gore because I Ooh. think he dresses fantastically. Yes. I think he's showing people you can actually be extra as a dude. Like there's no mm. need to hold yourself back. Come on, we work on a style. Oh, what are we going to struggle? Mm -hmm. So Seth Gore, keep doing what you do. Absolutely. Very. It's very flamboyant. I love it. I love the extraness. I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Love it. Okay, so now let's try pick somebody in Africa. And I feel like, yeah, I was going to be like, we have the same Bonang. name. Definitely. Bonang, Bonang can do no wrong in our eyes. Like, speak badly about Bonang. It's me and Laura are coming for you. you. Both coming for mm. you. Okay. But she's gorgeous. I saw her um, when Young Famous and African came out. And mm. she was, of course, invited to like all the premiere events uh, and even Real Housewives of Lagos. Mm. This girl came looking better than everybody, Bonang. It's not even your show. Bonang. Huh? Gorgeous, she wears the most incredible gowns and she works with a lot of African designers, but now she also works with a lot of international designers yeah. who really can't wait to dress her. Yeah. 
cute. Definitely. A lot of South African celebrities dress really nicely. Yes. Also, they they really, really pay attention to the entertainment scene. They really, really invest in it because... They really they, pay See, this well. is the thing, yeah. You they never really get tired of it. Well. Yeah, you never get tired. Yeah, please, you want to not to take to gigs there outside. We see you. We're complaining now. Call us for nice gigs. But uh, yeah, they really do invest in entertainment because I don't think there's ever a point in time in life where entertainment will ever go out of style. It'll keep evolving, I but agree. people will always look for outlets, you know, like unwind yeah. and you know, just immerse yourself in someone else's life and just exist in a exactly. movie. Exactly. Even just music. to be made to laugh. Like yeah. it's usually in the simplest ways. Exactly. Ooh, when you said someone to laugh, I think locally I changed my mind. Oh, who are you going with? Jackie. Oh. I don't know how to pronounce her last name. Jackie, okay. On Instagram, it's V-I-K-E. Yeah. Yeah. That one. VK. I like her. And she's my size, she, so I feel like accepted yes. there. I and feel then, at home. Like, she will honestly put in effort, yes. no matter what event she's going through. Even if it's just some brand immersion or some concert, this chick will put in, and she thinks about everything, from mm. her headscarf, to her hair, to her makeup, to the everything. jacket, all the way down to shoes and socks, man. She always looks well. Very beautiful. I think internationally, you should pick or go with a man okay. and a woman. Mm. Or, or should we do older and younger? Mm. Stormy Webster. Ooh. Younger. I see you. I see you. I see you too. There's the there's the the girl who is in Blackish. Ah, uh, what is Marisai her name? Marisai Martin. Thank you, Marisai Martin. First of all, she's like the youngest director and producer of films I don't know ever. Blah 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 blah. Mm -hmm. She released a nail brand and her nails are super cute. And as Laura told you, I really be loving nails. Yes. <laughs> so you know that her stuff is super gorgeous. But fashion wise, she always looks so incredible. And she's doing this thing that we kind of see young Hollywood stars transition mm. into where you have to like rebel from mm. like the Disney world that you came from. So you have to wear dark eyeliner and you have to show cleavage and show legs and you have to, but for her, it's been such a smooth transition. Exactly. And seeing her in dresses and gowns and oh, she just looks so nice. Style wise, when it comes to dudes, me, I, I'm a faithful fan. Okay. I'm a, I'm a Chris Brown. I knew you were going to say Chris Brown. I was like, so sorry, fashion Chris Brown, let's see my chocolate. <laughs> Everything. He's, he's, he's just, he's Look a good you. of goodness. You're even a mess just thinking about it. Gang. But Chris Brown, you should actually start coming to outside events again. I know things were rough. Yeah. But leave the alcohol and the drugs at home and you'll be fine. You guys are accusing him of things he doesn't even do. My God, look at her true Chris Brown fan. Anyway. <laughs> For men, guys, I am going to... Can I break two people? I want to break the rules. Yes. Uh, Billy... Why is his other name going? I do not agree with that. You I'm don't? I'm not even going to let you finish it. But tell me, help me no. with this. Not Billy Eilish, obviously. No. You know his last... Yes. What's his last name? No, I will not tell no, you. Oh, he looks good all the time, you guys. Why is he not guys, coming? I'm going to look picture. for it on Instagram. No, you, you're going to ah, see ah. the picture on screen and you will disagree as well. No, it's you won't. Much. You that won't. beard is too much. If you like style and you're into... First of all, I'm going to be... And Jake Lilna's ex, but not him. For real? Billy I Porter think doesn't Nas do it for me. Thank you. You said his name. Billy Porter. Oh, all his red carpet looks. The flow. The drama. I like it. Don't subscribe to this mentality. Okay, my second one, and I hope you'll be a little bit happy mm. about this one. And I think I have a small little crush on this guy because he's honestly doing the best movies and I'm really loving his performances. Mm -hmm. Timothy Chalamet. Oh, absolutely. Let me tell you, that man is absolutely beautiful. Tick, tick, tick. I want to know who, where he does his hair. Nana Pakanga, I want to know who birthed him. Skin. Because his skin is just, he should his just walk shirtless insane. forever. And he has no eye bags ever. So even whatever makeup he's using needs to put us on. He looks like a, okay, he is, I think, he but is, he's not he a baby. Is, he's not a baby. He's like he in his looks, early 20s. He looks like he just pasted skin from a baby to him. Yeah. Mm. I don't know what he's doing. I'm hearing what to Hollywood when kunya kunya damu to nko tunambiwa na hasa na sugar boy. Come on, damu na kunya endelea. If that's how you're looking. What? Pizza gate. <laughs> yes. We'll see you guys next week. Take care of you and others. I have been Sura Common and talk to us on the socials at KTN Home. Who are you yesterday since you have been Sura Common? Will you be? I was Sura Common during this episode when I leave here. Labda mini shiko ama mutoto adokas. Usinulize swalingumu. I'm a I'm a change. I'm a change. Anyway, it's still me. I'm for the streets. My name is Laura Mata. And let's talk on social media. That is at Mbaka Laura on all social media platforms. 
Hashtag KTM Home, the T. Subscribe, like, and share. Bye.